Hey guys, Ethan from Two Player Creations, and today I'm going to show you how to paint the armor and helmet from the Mandalorian series. We're going to start with a plain raw cast. I'll take you through the priming and layering steps, and right through to grime washing and highlights to get a nice movie quality finish. So our first coat, I'm just using Rust-Oleum Hammered Copper. Now, when this is layered up, it naturally separates, and that's going to create the texture base for the rest of our paint job. Just keeping the spray nozzle about 10 to 12 centimeters away, nice and close. You want it to build up enough that it starts to separate. Now for the second coat, I'm just using a basic metallic gold. It doesn't necessarily have to be rust I'm just whatever you can get your hands on. Well, when I'm doing this, I'm making sure I'm not completely covering the bronze underneath. I actually want it to show through just a little bit, just to create another layer of depth in the paintwork. Now once that gold's set, we're gonna do our first grind pass. This is a mix of a copper base with burnt sienna and black. I'm gonna water that down and just work it over the entire model. While that's still wet, just grab a scrap rag and just wipe away the paint, leaving it in areas where you want the contrast to sit. I'm also going to go through and just clean up areas where I want higher contrast, so I'll wipe away the paint and strip it right back to that gold base. Now second pass is a majority black base, but I'm mixing in some gold. Some people tend to do a harsh black wash, which can work for some projects, but for this I want it to be a more natural contrast gradient. For the highlights pass, I'm just using a light gold, dabbing on areas that I want to stand out. Then going through with my rag and just blending it back to those contrast colors. The horns are the easiest, we're just going to do a basic silver base, followed up with a silver black mix, wiping away to reveal the silver underneath. Awesome guys, hope you enjoyed that. Um, if you want to follow the process, you can just find my build albums on 2 Player Creations on Instagram and forward slash 2 Player Creations on Facebook. Um, let me know how it goes if you use this technique yourself and tag me up because I'd love to see your work.